guys, it's me, Crazy2200, and welcome to this YouTube video. Today in this video, I'm going to be giving you guys a my makeup collection video. This is actually the second time I've filmed it, so great. But yeah, I'm going to give you my makeup collection. I asked you guys on my Instagram at CrazyChickYT. You should go follow that if you're not already. Um, I asked if you wanted to see a makeup collection video or a what I've packed for holiday. I feel bad for the people who said the what I've packed for holiday, so I'm still gonna do that. But the makeup collection is coming first. But yeah, let's just get straight on to the video. Before we start, happy Easter, guys! Easter was pretty recently, and I'm sorry as always for the lack of uploads. Um, I've had a lot going on at the moment. At the end of January, I found out some news not the best, and uh, it's taken a big toll on me, but that's all right. And, you know, I'm not exactly ready to share with you guys yet, but I would like to at some point. But, yeah, um, now let's get straight on to the video. So I keep my makeup in the side part of my desk. I've got these three wire copper wire baskets from Primark. The small ones I believe are like three pound, and then this large one at the bottom, I think was five pound. And on the top one, I keep my everyday makeup. Then I have my palettes, and then just random makeup. Over on my cabinet, next to it, I keep all my main lipsticks here. I've just got some brands such as Kiko, PS, New Look, i got Freedom, I don't know what this one is, and I've got more Kiko, Claire's Makeup Revolution, and Maybelline. My favorite lipstick is this one here, this is the Kiko Milano Smart Lipstick in the old packaging. This was the sh this is in the shade, this is gonna focus, focus, 9... 918. This is absolutely amazing. It smells nice, tastes nice. It's a perfect color. It's just it's just the best lipstick in my in my opinion. But I've got some awesome other ones like this this um Kiko one. What's this? This is the Kiko Intense Color. Oh in the shade 01. Love that lipstick. Really nice packaging. PS one this PS lipstick here. Really nice, pretty pink color. I have this new look one, which is in out. So it's obviously rose gold packaging. This is in the shade Terracotta, and this is obviously a matte lipstick. And then I've just got some reds as well, even though I don't use red. I've got some reds. These three came in my advent calendar last year. And then I've got a over here, this Claire's dark purple one. Now I've got to get some different colors up here. So yeah, that's a gloss one type there. I got another nude. I got oh, I got a nude lipstick here in the same kind of. It's the same brand, and obviously packaging. I'm thinking just a different shade of my favorite lipstick. So this one's really good as well. I just prefer the color on that one. So I'm not really a fan of nudes, but those are my main lipsticks. And if we just scoot you over here, I have got my baby lips. I've just got the, my six baby lips, and then in the back here I've got little like travel size brushes. Like I've got a little set of unicorn ones, and then the uh, these. Makeup Revolution miniature ones from the advent calendar last year. So now going into my main everyday makeup basket, I've got products such as uh, Pixie by Petra Brow Tamer, my number seven lash impact lash primer, absolutely one of my favorite mascaras, Makeup Revolution eye primer. The Outdoor Girl Perfect Brows Grooming Kit. The Gucci Infinite Length Mascara. Yeah, guys, I'm part of the Gucci Gang. Boy, Gucci Gang, Gucci Gang, Gucci Gang. Yeah, that's embarrassing. Never. My foundation and concealer sponge. I've got three highlighters. The Makeup Revolution Rainbow Highlighter, Gradient Highlighter, and just a little, like, normal, what's to say, pressed highlighter. I have the... Hula, the Benefit Hula Bronzer, and a Freedom Pro Glow. This is sort of more, I use it more as a bronzer though than a highlighter. I have Pura Correcting Primer. I have the W7 Go Concealer, and also the Collection Illuminating Touch Brightening Concealer Stick. I have these two Kiko Single Eye Color, Eye, eye Colors, Eyeshadows. One, this one in the shade 143, and this one in 139. Really pretty, love those. I have these two blushes, the Kiko Smart Blush in the shade 03, and the MUA Pixel Perfect Multi Blush in the shade Pink Blossom. I've got a mirror, 
another Kiko eyeshadow. This is in a, this is a bright duo baked eyeshadow in the shade 03. A black and pink eyeliner. Another mascara, but this one's by Kiko Milano, the the unmeasurable length fiber. I've then got my Kiko Soft Focus Foundation Mineral Powder and my BB Cream by The Body Shop in the shade 02. That is everything in my everyday makeup box thing, I don't know. Next we are going to palettes. I have loads of W7 palettes, like I've got four. I've got two small ones. I have the in W7 in the City Natural Nudes. And then I have the W7 Midnight Smoky Shades miniature palette as well. These both contain six eyeshadows. Those are really nice. Love, I just love these brands. This is a good brand. I got these two big palettes by W7. One is the Color Me Buff. And one is... Okay, this is like really bad lighting. There you go. I got the W7 Color Me Buff. Which I love those colors. And then I've also got the W7... Color Me New Palette. This is probably my favorite, though. I love the W7. Love these pink shades. I see this one. This one's really pretty. I like that one. But, yeah, you know. Some really pretty shades. I've got a PS Love 8 Shade Day eyeshadow palette. Never been used, but it's beautiful. And I've got a Pop Beauty palette. I don't mind all the brokenness. Broken? Brokenness? Brokenness. It came in the post and it had an eye color, an eyeshadow cracked. And all the box was cracked. So, you know, my mom got a new one sent to her. But, you know, these eyeshadows are fine. So, yeah. We got this dead eye palette as well. I have two Makeup Revolution Remedation palettes. This one is in the shade Iconic 1. With these really pretty, like nudie glittery colors and then i've got this one which is acid brights this was like one pound so you know i can't go wrong with a pound can you i mean i might use these on halloween or something who knows but i think it's always useful to have every single color i've got two face palettes i've got this one which is the tanya Bear cosmetics rosy flush cheek palette this is really nice i love the i love the bronzer and the highlighter in this and the blush is really pretty it's a nice mirror fellow youtuber I'll look at that. i don't know her but yeah and then this is like my favorite palette of all time yes i have got a Too faced sweet peach glow palette this smells like peaches and it's so good obviously you got the highlighter the blusher and the bronzer it's just really pretty and i've never used it and then it came in this little like leaflet thing with how to use it because you know i suck when it comes to makeup i can't do makeup guys so i need help with this comment down below if you guys have any makeup tips because i would love to have them also, apologize for my nails, guys. I know they're absolutely gross right now. Some of them have lost, some of them haven't. I've lost half of, like, this one. Don't mind, I need to get them painted soon. So, I don't really know how to show you this eye palette, but this is a very big, as you can see. It's the Makeup Revolution 144 Ultimate Eyeshadow Palette for 2017. Oh my goodness, I'm, like, gonna knock stuff down, but there are loads of shades. 144 of them. But there's like only like a few matte shades. There's not really any like matte shades in there, which I wish they had more matte. You know what? I love this palette. So I've also got like loads of glittery colors just to, you know, mix in with everything. Last of all, I've got this makeup box. This is just all random stuff. As you can see, I've got my makeup remover wipes by Garnier. I have these Jack Will brushes in this little travel thing, and then a bunch of makeup, which I'm just gonna show you a few of them. I've got my Birchbox brush cleaner. I've got these two face products. I've got Nivea Day Cream, Nivea Day Cream, and this Balance Me Pure Skin Face Wash stuff. I've got the New York Color Mousse Foundation in the shade 700 Ivory, which is too dark for me. I have a Lord is that Lord Lord and Berry concealer stick. This model co conceal conceal and correct stick. And then the Outdoor Girl Flawless Foundation. I've got my baby lips balm and blushes. A bunch of sponges. These weird brushes, but you know what? They look really pretty, so I kept them. I've got some blushes. These ones I don't know what they're from. They came like a gift set when I went on holiday. And I've got W7 powder blush. This is in the shade Baby Pink, even though it's like bright pink. I've got a glittery kabuki brush from kabuki brush from Claire's. A selection of miniature eye palettes. I've got some from Claire's here, glitter one and just a normal one. This one I don't remember why this what brand this is. And then a New York color little one as well. I've got this Rimmel London single eyeshadow as well. This is in the shade 
440 enchantment. I've got highlighter galore. Um, W7 Glow Commotion Shimmer Highlighter Eyeshadow. I've got a bunch of Makeup Revolution eyeshadow, eyeshadows, highlighters. This is a Strobe Bomb in Rose Gold. I've got Flash a Baked Highlighter, and this is also a, this is a Rejuvenate Baked Highlighter. Really, really pretty. Also, this blush highlighter thing. I don't really know what this is, but it's pretty cool. My spare mascaras. I've got a waterproof one by Avon. This W7 Eye Lust. Really pretty. And then this is a little, like, I guess, travel-sized one. Don't know what brand this is. This is, uh, I don't know. I can't read that, but... Yeah, another little miniature. Um, mascara. A Field Day Lipstick in the shade 1. So these are all my, like, li liquid lipsticks. They're all practically, like, the same shade. I've got this W7 Mega Matte Lip one. This New Look Matte Lipstick in the shade Nude Pink. Got this Super Matte Liquid Lipstick in the shade Kim from PS. And then this one, which came in a birch box, which is, like, a gloss, but it's really pretty still. I've got Eyelash Curler, a Sharpener, a little brow palette by City Color Collection. I got this like white eye pencil liner thing. I've got these little eyeshadows. This is by the Color Workshop. Oh, that's what um these blushes were from. The Color Workshop. They came like a set. And it's like a little removable eye palette thing. You can like take out the color and decide which one you want with you. So I got this little palette one. This one this one and this one so I can swap out which one I want. Two Jack Wills lip balms in obviously berry and rose. I've got this little white shimmery single eyeshadow. A brown eyeliner by Rem and a bunch of random lip color stuff like this Kiko Urban Sheen lip gloss. These are Makeup Revolution lip gloss and sticks. I got like a little lip crayon thing here by Rimmel, I think. Yeah, Rimmel London. A new look matte velvet lipstick crayon. And I don't know what shade these are. And then two little Makeup Revolution glosses, like a bright pink one and then a normal pink one. And then I've got this little Go Go, -Go Tint Benefit like lip tint, which is really bright. I don't understand how this is a tint. Because, like, it's a full-on lip. But, you know, always interesting to have. And to finish off the video, I'm just going to show you some of my brushes. I've got all sorts of different brands. i got Claire's, Isabella Sculpt, Look Good, Feel Better, Real Techniques, The Cream Shop, PS, more PS. I've got loads, actually. Goodness, I've got, like, random, like, no-branded ones as well. Spectrum over here, and I've got a body shop. Um, this is like a Julie or something like that. Just loads of different um, brushes. Brushes. This is my favorite. This is the Isabella Scott blush brush. It's lovely. This is my favorite one. It's so soft. Yeah, that's my makeup collection. So guys, that's the end of this video. I hope you enjoyed my makeup collection. If so, please give this video a like. A like would be very appreciated. Make sure you hit that subscribe button down below. I know I don't upload often, but when I do, you guys enjoy it. Also, go and follow my Instagram, at CrazyJackYT, for probably more polls. Because I think I'm going to do more of those than the videos that I upload. I know you guys are going to like. So, yeah. Um, hope you enjoyed. Sorry for the lack of uploads. Happy Easter, and I'll see you guys in my next video. Bye, guys!